60. Well, there's the uh, lineup for this next event on the track, the men's at 200 meters B race. Warren Weir goes in this one though, the 25 year old is the silver medalist from Moscow two years ago for Jamaica. Well, they're out there stripped down and ready. And we keep tracksuits on. It's a nice evening. Morris Mitchell of the USA is a 2046 performer this year. He's 26 years old now, Mitchell. Tracy Taekwondo with his uh, number upside down. The uh, Jamaican that goes in lane three. Curtis Mitchell in lane four. Bronze medalist in the World Championships in Moscow. Only a semi finalist in the US Championships, though he has had his problems this year. 2068, he's only sixth in his semi final in Eugene. And then Kenji Fujimitsu. 29 year old is the best of 2032 this year. He's in really good form, the Japanese. Good lane draw, two lane five. Warren Weir, another that Jamaican production line of great young sprinters. He is 25 now, though. Season best of 20.26. His lifetime best, 19.79. He came in that final in Moscow a couple of years back. He's also got a pretty good range of other events. More of that in a minute. Alonso Edward goes in lane seven for uh, Panama. Fourth in the New York Diamond League in 2062. The World Championship silver medalist back in 2009, Edward. Seems like he's been around a long time, but he's only 25. And then this man is rather special, the 22-year-old South African, Wade Van Niekerk. Third fastest up 400 this year in the world. Goes to the University of Free State in Bloemfontein. And he uh, shocked many, many people with a fabulous African record in the Paris Diamond League meeting where he won, beat Karani James. What's up? Uh, 10 days ago, 43.96 he ran there. It was an African record, but it lasted less than 24 hours. It was beaten in Cholafon in Switzerland uh, just a day later by Isaac Makwala, who ran uh, 43.72. But Van Niekup, with that sort of 400 form in his legs, will be very interesting to see what he can do from lane eight in this 200. Morris Mitchell in two, Tra Taekwondo Tracy in three. Curtis Mitchell in four, Fujimitsu five, Warren Weir in six, watch him, Alonzo Edwards seven, Van Niekirk nearest the camera in lane eight. He'll come late, I suspect, as a 400 meter specialist on the outside. Well, really good start by there, Alonzo Edward in lane seven, second to left, also good bend by, Fuj by Fujimitsu. The Japanese certainly led round the bend, but here comes Van Niekirk on the outside. Bottom left of picture, he's holding the mud at the moment. He's going to take it here by half a metre from Alonzo Edward. Fujimitsu in third place, 19.95. Breaking new ground all the time. That is absolutely fabulous. His season's best Van Nieker, 20.59. He has found a vein of form that has eluded him throughout his young career so far. Martin is improving hand over fist, this young man. He was second in the African Championship 400 last year. He was fourth in the World Junior 200 back in 2010, which perhaps is telling. So this improvement is long overdue, but 1994, the performance of the night so far. Well, the 400 meters at the World Championships is shaping up to be one of the classic events. And when you're capable of running sub-20, as this fella is, Wade van Niekerk, it'd be difficult to oppose him. And here he is, running against world-class 200-metre specialist Alonzo Ed Edward. Remember him as a teenager, running home Usain Bolt in his world record run in Berlin back in 2009. He's wiped the floor with him, the likes of Curtis Mitchell, Morris Mitchell, Warren Weir. Can get nowhere near Wade van Niekerk. He's a 400 meter specialist, that leap from two to four. Well, we saw Michael Johnson do it, but he really was a one-off. Well, at least I thought he was a one-off. Maybe this man is following in similar footsteps. Well, it's not an easy leap, is it? Certainly, uh, you know, many people don't manage it. 1994 is confirmed, though, for Wade Van Nieker, and wait for it, in zero wind. Imagine if he'd had a little gust behind him. He'd have gone down to... Uh... Well, a lot quicker, let's say. There's confirmation of the win. 20.03 for Alonzo Edward. That's good running from him, a good step forward. Kenji Fujimitsu, 21.3 for the Japanese. That is a season's best as well.